What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome back to another FC24 video. It is 6pm, it is Thursday, it is the final day of the Thunderstruck promo. But don't worry because tomorrow, oh it didn't show a, hold on I want to get the splash screen. Tomorrow we are going to be getting the brand new radioactive promo. And it has to be said that this is the first time in a very, very long time that I think, no, EA, please show me the thing that I think the card designs are utter trash. <laughs> like They just look horrible. Let me know what you think about the card designs down below. It's, yeah, there you go. They just don't look nice, right? Yeah, they just don't look nice. I don't know. I don't like them. Um, but anyway, let's see what we've got for today. In objectives, do we have anything new in objectives? No, we do not in FC Pro. As expected, nothing uh, in live. Nothing in seasonal. And nothing in milestones. If you want to be able to afford the best players and open the best packs in FC24, go to u7buy.com to buy your EAFC24 coins. It's cheaper than buying FC points and just as reliable. They already offer some of the best prices out there, but you can get an extra 6% off using promo code NEP at checkout. But do we have new evolutions? AKA Nevolutions. No, we do not. Fair enough, EA. Fair enough. Do we have anything in SBCs? I wouldn't be surprised if there was nothing today. I really wouldn't. There's another daily login if you need it. Um, there's, I don't think there's a player there. I really don't think there's anything. Oh, there you go. Thierry Correa. He's new. But that's it. Upgrades. The base hero player pick is re-upped today, isn't it? Um, which is quite nice. Otherwise, nothing there. There's new marquee matchups for a premium gold players pack. There's sneaker and stuff kit. And there's no new icon. I did, I, I did, I did genuinely expect not a lot today. You know, like, fair play to EA. This week of content has been sensational. Like, it had to, like, wind down eventually. Um, so, market matchups for a premium gold players pack requires Atletico Madrid versus Barcelona. You need one player from each club, can include the women's club, so those players will go up in value. Prime Electrum players. Newcastle versus Man United, you need one each of those as well, so they will go up for a jumbo premium gold pack. Uh, Final against PSV for a jumbo gold pack, you need two Eredivisie players. And Al Halal against Al Nazar for a premium gold pack. Those rewards aren't actually that bad, to be fair. That's a decent uh, marquee matchup set of rewards uh, right there. All of my favourites have gone. That's fun. Um, so the player that we got was Thierry Correa. Uh, Three-star, four-star. Right back, right wing back, and right mid. Great pace. How is this an 85-rated card? How is this an 85-rated card? He has literally got acceleration and sprint speed above 85, jumping at 85, and everything else lower than 85. Most of it in the 80s and 70s. This, 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 ha this might go down as like the worst 85 rated card in history. Got some cool play styles. Anticipate, intercept, and bruiser. He's got rapid and quick step, but what, what's the point? He's three-star, four-star. He doesn't even four-star, four-star. I mean, there's not even a chem style that can save this guy. Like, even if you put an anchor on him and he gets, like, reasonable defending and physical with great pace, his dribbling and passing is awful for a fullback. Man, that, that's a really disappointing player. I can't lie. This needs to be, like, an 82-rated squad. It's an 83 with an inform. It's like a 50k squad. EA, do you not realise informs right now are like 45k because there's no way to get them, but they are needed in everything. Yeah, that's bad. That, that's poor from EA, that is. That is poor. There wasn't anything in the uh, upgrades, was there? There was not. And then we got the sneaker and stuff. A kit. 
It requires 11 gold, 10 rares. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll pass on that one. Thanks anyway. Um, into the store. We go. 10 coin pack is back. The 30 coin pack is gone. So, go and open your 10 coin packs. You know you want to. You know you want to. 10 coins doesn't even matter. It doesn't matter what you get. It's a, it's a bonus. Anything you get is a dub. Right there. 85. Yeah, exactly. 85 doesn't even get a double upgrade. He'll, he'll only go to an 86. It's, it, it's genuinely a horrific SBC. Um, any other fun promo packs? I mean, there's a lot of promo packs, but... Not interested. Not interested. Not interested. Man. As I say, I, 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 I'm not... I'm not even like, you know, sometimes when there's no content, I'm like, oh, my days, EA, like, what the hell? There is still a lot of content there, right? There's still a lot to do. There's still a lot of things out there. There's still a whole bunch that you can kind of, like, get involved in and, and look at and, and, and like, work towards and progress towards. Um, I, I'm shocked that people are upvoting this card. Like, shocked. I, I, like, I know it's, like, very dramatic, right? But I genuinely believe this is one of the worst SBCs in the history of the game. And I say, I know that's, like, slightly dramatic, but if this card is on the market as a gold card, if, if this card is on the market as this card, it's 10,000 coins, and you could discard it and get your coins back. If this card is on the market as an 85-rated gold card, it is fodder. They have given him two pace upgrade, 11 shooting, 7 passing, 8 physical, 8 defending, 6 dribbling for the first upgrade. You put an anchor on him. Yeah, this is like exactly as what I said when we was looking at him, right? Great pace, all right defending, nothing crazy, all right physical, nothing crazy. Bang average dribbling and bang average passing for a fullback in a game that really relies on dribbling and passing from your fullbacks. Playstyles are quite nice, and he has potential, potential to get upgraded. But 55,000 coins. Compare him to Kyle Walker. Look at Kyle Walker, 16,000 coins. Kyle Walker's got better passing, better physical, worse defending, worse dribbling, a little bit less pace, probably better links. Can't get upgraded, but Kyle Walker's 16,000 coins. And because of Kyle Walker's links, he's probably a little bit more expensive. If we look at like Hakimi instead, who I'd say is probably a little bit of a better comparison set up. Hakimi's got same pace, more passing, one less dribbling, same physical, a bit less defending, but does have four star, four star, and again, better links, and he's 4,800 coins. I just, I, I like I say, I just think that this card. This, if he was gold on the market, I think he's Hakimi sort of price, four, five, six, seven k. If he's the special card on the market, like look at Tierney, who's now a uh, an eighty six rated, twelve k, twelve k, and this card is much better. Tierney's got four less pace, more shooting, more passing, more dribbling, more defending, and way more physical. Okay, he's had one upgrade, but he's had one upgrade, right? And he's 12k. Ex-Arsenal bias? No, no. Brains in head bias, right? Has eyes in skull bias, right? You look at this Kieran Tierney and you compare him to Correa and you would 100% without a doubt want Kieran Tierney over him. Now, okay, one of them's a left back, one of them's a right back, but it, go, it, it just lends to what this card would be on the market. I wouldn't mind it. I actually think it would be, dare I say, perfectly priced if informs weren't an exorbitant price. But because they are, this SBC is a dumb price. Now, apparently, you can Evo, you can Evo him. No, you can't. You, you only get, he's, he's not fit into any Evos, probably because of that 90 base pace. But you probably have got Evos that are better than him. The only thing, the only thing that he's got in his favour is anticipate playstyle. That's it. 
Um, but that is the content for today. Yeah, Marky Matchups is legit this week. I like it. I am absolutely blown away this is getting like any upvotes at all. I, I like genuinely surprised in, in, in the community. But thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed it. And I'll see you tomorrow for Radioactive.